you see that that is what they're doing. While, <clears throat> for different reasons, and we can study that, the emerging countries came out of the crisis quicker. In part because we decided to adopt policies that were not the ones that were forced on us in Latin America in the 80s and Asia in the 90s. And we were very glad to pay back to the IMF and to say the next time there's a crisis, we want to manage it on their own. This is what happened this time. So the issue of how is it that we shape the future is going to depend on an enormous amount on the ideas and the perspectives and the thinking that we can generate from the South. So again, President Kappa, Martin, Deepak, members of the, of the board, I think that you have done a fantastic job, but the job that we have in front of us is even great because the potential for helping to shape what is going to come in the future when the crisis in Europe is what it is and the situation that we've seen in the United States is what it is uh, implies that there's a certain responsibility to be able to put those ideas on the table not just to defend our interests but to help shape a much better world than the, than the one we had before the crisis and definitely the one we have now. So again, congratulations for the work you've done, it's fantastic. And, uh, and it's going gonna, it's gonna, it, it, it's, it's to have, it has had, but it's going to have in the future a much greater need and a great, make greater impact precisely because of the things that I'm saying. So thanks a lot. Thank you very much, President. A great pleasure to see you again. Thank you. Thank you. Does anybody else want to say something? <laughs>